My name is Jesse, and I'm the worship pastor at Calvary. Today I'll be sharing my journey to freedom. Growing up in San Diego, my parents taught me about Jesus and the importance of having God in my life. At a young age, I gave my life to Christ, and I love to worship Him. In high school, I started playing music at church in the youth band and writing original songs. After high school, I walked away from church, mostly because my focus shifted and it became about wanting success and a music career. Slowly, my relationship with God faded into the background and it moved into a phase of selfish desires. I started drinking, partying, and living a lifestyle that I knew was not right as a follower of Christ. But I shoved down those feelings and kept living for myself in worldly desires. That led to nothing but destructive paths. I still believed in God, but I was living in sin and not willing to change. As time went on, I tried to fulfill my life with, with success, career goals, parties, and momentary joys. They all led to disappointment, emptiness, and no fulfillment. In 1999, my uncle Mickey invited me to church and I decided to go. When everyone started to worship, my heart softened, tears were rolling down my face, and I knew in that moment, God is who had been missing in my life. It was the first time in a while I had felt pure joy. I decided in that moment, I was gonna surrender my life to Christ again and follow His will, to ask for forgiveness and to heal my brokenness. It took some time, but as I kept getting into the Word and praying for God to take away my struggles and selfish desires, He started changing my heart. To help me stay strong in His path, I started surrounding myself with other believers, going back to church, joining Bible studies, and finding my identity in Christ. I started to trust my life with God. Because of His forgiveness, I was free. A new everlasting life, a new identity in Jesus. Galatians 5.1 says, It is for freedom that Christ has set us free. Stand firm, then, and do not let yourselves be burdened again by a yoke of slavery. Now my life mission, passion, and prayer is to share the life-giving good news of Jesus. My desire is to be deeply rooted in Christ, to be an example for my family and children. He's given me freedom from death and destruction. He's given me purpose and a heart to tell others of the hope, forgiveness, redemption, healing, joy, and eternal life that only He can give. One of my favorite verses in the Bible is Proverbs 3, 5. And it says, trust in the Lord with all of your heart and lean not on your own understanding. In all your ways acknowledge Him and He shall direct your paths. Relationship is built on trust. Will you trust Jesus with your life in all areas? Will you share the good news and story of forgiveness and redemption that Christ has given you? My prayer is that you will and that you will continue to grow your roots deep in Christ. Have a blessed week, and may the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in Him, so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Have a great day.